I'd like to welcome the thousands of people who have come to the realization that a colossal perpetration against all of humanity has taken place on earth. That's right. A massive and ongoing lie about who we are and what is really out there. Now this ridiculous charade is somewhat self-sustaining, largely due to the ignorance of academia as well as those who follow it as the gospel. Those who propagate these lies don't realize that they are being misled and used from the top. Most carry out these infractions against the people unknowingly. It's time to wake up and smell them or captain. In our first big production, Planet Mars, it's not just a rock. We brought to your attention this image a wide mosaic assembled using numerous rover curiosity images. Present is a large rectangular clearing, a strong indication that someone has already been here. Also, a foundation and the possible ruins of a former structure. Even a large Martian effigy. Now that mosaic lives in sort of infamy amongst internet anomaly hunters because there is so much evidence to see there. It's hard to imagine how a large rectangular clearing with an adjacent rise exposing what appears to be walls can be so easily ignored. You know, to just turn away from that saying, no, that could be a lot of things. You're either amongst the brainwashed or perhaps you suffer from some type of ego-based denial. Now you might want to address this because this isn't going away. It's real. Now some believe that this was released for the purpose of seeing just how far they can go with people still ignoring and rejecting it. NASA's rover Curiosity passed through this area from Martian days Sol 522 to Sol 540. Now going into NASA's archives from those days, we find the images used to create this mosaic, as well as other interesting images of the area that you may not realize even exist. We will start with Sol 527. Now this is great because we have a different angle showing that same area of exposed walls and supports. I don't see how anyone can even think this is just a bunch of boulders lying around. Now the link is provided in the video description, so please download for yourself. These images tell a tale, but remember, even with all that we can see, there is still roughly 75% that is skillfully hidden from you in most of these images. We'll show examples of how that's being accomplished. We've got flat surfaces, as well as an apparent support column. These are either the remains of walls or flooring. Now that looks like a headpiece and is actually clear in the photo using the mosaic. But the inscription we found years ago 
is erased in this image. I think I'll shut up. Just let the images speak for themselves for now.